foremost, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Make sure you hit the like button. Make sure you hit the notification bell. And the most important thing, you already know what it is. The a fire emoji right after why so serious. Err. You gotta put the err. I greatly appreciate it. This is a cold Do you know what you're saying? Why so serious? Err. Why so serious? What's going on, Serious Nation? It's your guy, Serious Mindset, and I'm back with another video. And uh, as you see in the description, we are going to be changing out the regular uh, spoiler on the wide body, and we are going to be putting a uh, performance uh, performance uh, spoiler on there, commonly known as the demon spoiler or the red eye. You know, so many people got so many uh, names for this bad boy, but I need to make room. Ugh. So I, I did do a little cleanup of the garage because it's been a while, you know, because uh, after I did the uh, the lift uh, system, as you see, I got this thing on uh, monster truck mode. But after I did the lift system, you know, the garage was just all messed up. So I kind of did some tighten up. So this is the... Uh, this is the you see that's the bad boy that that hangs over that hangs over right there so I'll, you know what the the thing about at first you can't really tell the difference as far as you know the the spoiler right so if you look at any challenger that has no spoiler it looks it just looks confusing and crazy but if you see ones with this uh, type of spoiler, which is okay, it came it came with the 2020 wide body. As you see, it has the scat pack right here. So I'm not going to be debadging uh, this one to put on the uh, the performance spoiler. But the reason as well why I'm changing it is because if you guys been watching uh, the videos and you guys been following me for a while, um, you would know that. I, during a mod, I end up scratching with one of these uh, poles from my wife uh, uh, event planning deals and it just came down and scratched right here. So I'm glad that it scratched. Golly, look at all that dirt. I'm glad that it scratched here rather than somewhere right here. So nevertheless, I've been wanting to either wrap it or, um, or just do something different and you know you may think like oh man just do a wicker bill uh no nah, it's a little bit more than that so i really like the that other uh spoiler um uh, because you know i've seen the man um the man's you know he's he's uh he's dropped down too you probably seen him in a couple of my videos but you know i was like man i like that man where'd you get that from at first he was gonna sell it then he's like, nah, I'm gonna keep it. So I was like, ah, uh. I'm like, all right, watch the series, uh. But first and foremost, um, we're already a little bit more into the video, but first and foremost, make sure you hit the subscribe button, make sure you hit the like button, make sure you hit the notification bell, and the most important thing, you already know what it is. The A Fire emoji right after why so serious. Err, uh. you gotta put the err. Uh. I greatly appreciate it to it so I think the first thing is taking off yeah so taking that off so we got one we got two so we're gonna try to figure this out together so hopefully I don't scratch up my freaking uh, deal here so we're gonna put them right here so as you know um, I will go back and redo my configuration for the tank uh i mean for my trunk setup but you know it's working for right now so if it ain't broke don't don't fix it so then we're gonna pop we're gonna pop one and these come in handy make sure you guys get you uh get you a good set of these uh of these little pop out deals or whatnot because man if you try to do it with your nails Sheesh, the trouble will come for you. The trouble will come for you. Golly! What's the serious term? All right, so we got...
so I'm gonna walk you through what I did thus far. So, um, what I did, of course, as you guys seen, I took off the, uh, I took off the, I call it the carpet, whatever, whatever you guys want to call it. I call it the foam carpet. So I took off the foam carpet. You gotta pop off all the little clips. As you see, I put everything in the, uh, in the trunk because I don't want to, I don't want to lose it. You don't, you just don't want to lose it. And then we took off the, uh, the nut here, one, and then nut here two. And then, of course, we're going to loosen up the camera. So now the camera is now disengaged. Now, uh, if I stand corrected, uh, I have to undo some, uh, it's supposed to be like some, some rivets here. Somewhere right here is like some rivets. Oh, oh, they just popped out like that. Wow. I am so strong. <laughs> so as you see, that came up and I literally just did it like, I don't know if it's cause it's a new vehicle and it hasn't set in yet, but let's see, let's see if this side gonna be simple. Yep, that one kind of popped up too. So you see this one kind of popped up as well. So I can put my hand underneath or not hand, but it don't look like the sticky back don't even look like it really stuck in there. So I know it's some, uh, some push clips in here so what I'm gonna do is uh, we're going going to we're going to pull this joker out so we're gonna pull this baby out um I don't know if I'm gonna use that one so you probably might try to pry it with this one, we want to use plastic, not metal. So, I don't know how thick this thing is. Or not thick, but I don't know how far I gotta go. So, uh, we don't want to scratch up the paint, but we just want to try to kind of lift it up a little bit. So, we're gonna try that. Let's see how easy it is. Cause everything, I make everything so easy and then come to find out, I end up breaking something or having to redo or order something else so it never fails but I do take pride over all my mods so I always take pride on your mods you know what I'm saying so you know it beats you know paying somebody over and over doing stuff that you can easily do because you know you're scared or you're nervous hey look go to YouTube school watch some serious <clears throat> all right this kit came from Amazon so I get all my stuff literally from either Amazon or Harbor Freight because it's cheap, you know what I mean? You know, you still want to be gentle, be careful, guys. Like I said, you just don't want to scratch up the paint. Nobody wants you to scratch up the paint. Clip to this. Ah! Alright, so <laughs> we're about what 10? What is this 15 minutes in? So we're about 15 minutes in and I'm still I'm I'm still wrestling with it because I like I said I'm trying not to pop or break it's easier said than done. Um I don't know if you guys can see but right here these are the only two uh like pop in because they just like so let me see. So they're just like this one right here. Uh, you really can't see it. So let me try to get it off and then I'm gonna show you guys what I'm struggling with.
All right, guys, so I was able to get it off, but let me tell you something. It was a struggle. So if you're struggling, make sure you have the proper tools. So I used this tool that came out of, uh, like, if anything, guys, get your interior uh, pulley kit type deal on Amazon. It helps you with every situation. But nevertheless, uh, what I was able to do, I'm going to show you guys, what I was able to do is use these pieces carefully carefully to try not to scorch up the paint and um and use this for the double side of the adhesive tape so dab jab 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 and then it just popped up uh like so so now we're gonna be able to take it off and uh get going sweetheart what are you doing Whew, talk about pain in the butt so let me see oh i think i kind of scratched up the paint yeah, you kind of, I don't know if you guys can see it, but I kind of scratched up trying to get, trying to get underneath there. Yeah, you kind of can see it. So what I'm going to do is uh, clean the surface off. So you got to make sure the surface is clean to the fullest. And I don't know how it gets that dirty. But um, so I'm going to go ahead and clean the surface off, prep it. And uh, I might end up trying to get that little swirl mark off i don't know ocd type stuff so just stay tuned guys um as you know uh, the performance is right there ready to get installed so look how look, it's ready look 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 at that that thing just ready ready all right guys so stay tuned all right guys so i i did scratch up the paint um using the tools I did scratch up the paint. Um, as you see, I got a, I got a, I got a little bit more uh, residue on here, and I'm, gonna, I'm gonna deal with that later. But uh, I was trying to get as much of the uh, scratches that I, that I seen on here. But um, the most important thing that I, I'm just glad it's not gonna show. But nevertheless, um, I know on the actual uh, performance spoiler that they have the, uh, they have the double sided adhesive tape just like the one that they had here but this one didn't stick for whatever reason so I was able to pull it out so these are the problem areas so when you try to lift this baby up these are your problem areas that you try to get off but be careful um, if you try not to um, if you're trying not to damage the uh, the actual paint on the uh, on the rear end which looks hideous by the way so it needs a spoiler so it don't show all that we're going to grab this foil around her. Alright. We're going to take off one. This double side of these, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay. Take out one, two, three. And then we're going to do. Don't be honking at me! And that's the camera. Alright guys, so uh I always got problems with, with uh my battery. Right, let me take off these gloves. Come on, So what I'm trying to do is take off uh the the yeah blah 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 blah. Alright, so the adhesive uh the double side adhesive tape. I took a strip off, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna set everything in place, and then once I set everything in place, then I'm gonna pull the last strip, and then I'm gonna pl place it down. Oh, this was smart. Thank you to the smart person who did that. Take off this plastic over here. And before I set everything down, so as you see, I got the uh, double side adhesive tape peeled on one side, so I'm just gonna rip it. Uh, once I get somewhat settled. Alright. Alright. Alright, so now that we got everything peeled off, we can just easily set it in place. Everything popped in there. Oh, don't that look 
better? Look at that. Ooh. What y'all think? That look hot. All right. So the most important part as well is to make sure that you connect your camera because we need that. The hardest part for me was basically just taking the, uh, taking the, the first spoiler off because of the double side of the adhesive tape. But uh, nevertheless, guys, I appreciate you guys for watching. I'm going to show you guys a little overview of it once I put back everything and then we're going to go for a gym run. So I appreciate you guys. Stay serious. Stay motivated. Watch the zers. This is a cold boy. Do you know what you're doing? Watch the zers.